Well, here's another gorgeous Mercedes in my book. This is Craig's. That's Craig. 1986. 560 SEL. And if this does not scream Miami Vice, I don't know what does. This is the type of ride that the finest drug lord would cruise. Or the most efficient businessman going down the Autobahn. If you want luxury and you want to cruise on the highway like you're floating on a memory foam highway, then this is the ride for you. This is what, a 5.6 liter V8? 5.6. So this was made, obviously, uh, the W126 was from what, 1986 to 91? I think so, yeah. Yeah, I think. I could be wrong on that. But amazingly enough, the interior of this is quite nice. Um, what do you call this? Brown leather? Buffalo? Uh, buffalo. It could be buffalo. Yeah, it's like a it's like a type <laughs> it could, of leather. It's like could, a buffalo hide. Yeah, we'll just call it buffalo brown. <laughs> <laughs> you got and uh, but I mean honestly it, it's it's incredibly roomy. The back seat, uh, there's Otto right there. He can uh, he is looking extra roomy back here. But, I mean, look at the foot, the, the amount of legroom here is incredible. Um, as you can see, the, uh, the legroom in this vehicle is probably the best feature of the W126. No. Reclining and heated rear seats. Oh, you are kidding me. Yeah, watch, watch auto, you ready? Well, that's heated, but well, we'll figure that out. But obviously the legroom is phenomenal for this car. Um, it's like our like monoblock wheels. It's so cool, it just screams 80s. The, now, now, now here. You got it to work. The trunk, I don't think works. No, it does, I just gotta get the key to unlock it. Oh yeah, okay, yeah, we don't do that. So this fact from the factory has heated seats and reclining seats. I kid you not, the rear seats recline and are heated from 1986. That's more futuristic than Otto's Frisbee. Interior wise, I think is just, I mean, this, this car is pretty ahead of its time. The, the driver's cockpit, I mean. Can you unlock everything from here? I don't know, you could try that. Where's the unlock button? Mm, that this, happens. This car has 248,000 miles and it looks pretty dang good for that amount of mileage. I mean, look at this radio. Tape deck. Decker Grand Prix. How cool is that? Of course you have to have the wood accents because if you didn't have wood... Oh, it has he and look at that, it has electric headrests. I mean, electric headrests from 1986? Yeah. And of course, a healthy V8. <laughs> yeah, real healthy. <laughs> um, well, we're gonna pop the hood. You can take a look at. <clears throat> also, electric seats for the front, obviously. But I don't know. I think that's fascinating for. What is this color called? Welcome to America Beige. Welcome to America Beige. If you're looking for the best color to get in this car, is welcome to America Beige. Factory, do these work still? You're gonna find out. There's no clue if the uh, headlight windshield washer, or I should say, well, those, those work. God dang, oh, this also has two different horns. I kid you not, what, what is, one is the... This is the normal city horn. Okay. And then this is the town. Wow. <clears throat> How do you, uh, you think you're, uh... Oh, here we go. Oh, no way. They worked? Oh, my God. They still, look at this. They still work. They are... That is beautiful. All right, well, I'm going to hold this real quick, so I'm going to open up this hood. This <clears throat> was when, uh... Highway speeds were priority and gas mileage was not. 
I mean, look at the size of this, this motor. Unfortunately, the tick is an exhaust uh, manifold gasket, but that can be easily fixed. Yeah. It's giant. It's just a giant motor. Look at the size of the battery. You can start a Caterpillar with this. It's a nice car. What's your favorite feature about this car? You look like a dictator. You do look like a dictator. That is. I even got you the South African uh, flags that we never put on this. I know. Where were those? Those are sitting on the counter. <laughs> literally. Well, let's go for a cruise. <clears throat> I feel like I should sit in the back. I almost. I think you should sit in the back. All right. So we're going to go cruise in this gorgeous 560 SEL 1986. My personal favorite is the color of this car, but also just the sheer size of, wow, we are moving. The Uber has arrived and uh, hello Benson. How do you do today? Any business deals? Uh, I see. Sir, I am not allowed to say to discuss business deals. Does your sunroof work on this? Oh, maybe it might. She might free up. Oh yeah, she can pop open. There oh, we go. Nice. there we go. Very nice. Yeah. That probably hasn't been used in the last 30 years. No, yeah. So, <clears throat> definitely not. But the, uh, and these windows, do they work? Wow. Class. Why don't you recline your seat? I just might. Well, now we're going to proceed to do a couple of donuts. I wonder if this thing could do donuts. I re you should really actually try it. I'll get a video of it. Let's go. That was massive. All right. <laughs> the guy in the fucking door over there is my honk. <laughs> <laughs> I am getting back in the dictator mobile. It is proven that a 560 will, in fact, do donuts. We are out of here for the next installment of this wonderful review. I, I was not actually expecting that. Neither was I. It, this thing probably weighs 5,000 pounds. And uh, the next one, yeah, so we'll just go left over there. This thing will in fact slide. Well, you see I mean, all- there's a, there's a big- Right there. Where the trucks, where the oh. trucks get loaded in, that's a big concrete patch. So I oh, don't yeah. know where the trucks are at. You know, you see all those movies like Die Hard, I've always thought that was a joke. The Miami Vice, they'd be sideways in this with Lamborghini nah, Countach and this puppy. Oh. And and um, <laughs> what do we got here? No, oh, that's not even a cop safety. Oh tip. yeah. Whew. Okay. I was like, uh, uh oh. <laughs> oh dear. Otto, what'd you think of the drifting? How, what would you rate that at? Well, six. That's not bad. Oh yeah, this could be good over here. Almost clear. Ready? Here's the acceleration test. <laughs> He's getting there. Blindingly fast. Oh. 